Well, I'm Vicki Titi, and I wrote When Your Husband is Addicted to Pornography, Healing Your Wounded Heart. This is part of my story. The pornography is part of my story. And when I went through this and was ready to start healing, I found excellent resources. There's not a ton of resources, but what there is available for women, there's some really excellent things as far as understanding the addiction, understanding how you can help your husband. What I didn't find was, what about me? What, and it, does anybody care about how I'm feeling about this? If the statistics are even close to accurate, I mean, they say 50% of Christian men. I've heard a crazy, 60 million people addicted to pornography in the United States right now is a figure I just recently heard. I can't really wrap my head around that. But on a Sunday morning when I look around my church and I imagine from the center aisle to the right, and if, if 50% is accurate, then the men sitting in that section are struggling. And then that means that the woman sitting on the left or right of them is struggling too. This is the kind of book that you buy and you keep, and then when your girlfriend calls, or your sister calls, or the woman down the street calls, you hand them the book. There's tremendous um, relief for a woman in knowing that she's not alone that she's not the only one who's experienced this. So often when I'm, I'm speaking to a group of women, someone will approach me and say, that's exactly how I feel. How did you know? And it's because I've been there. And, and I think that it resonates for women to hear other people's stories. I've written it in such a way that you're processing and you're writing out answers and I'm asking you to think about things and dig deep. And okay, here's what Jesus says about this. How does that fit your situation right here? I, I certainly see it being used in churches with lay ministry leaders leading those groups. I see it being used by counselors who already have support groups. I can also see, and I've had women use it in this way, that they've done the work and then taken their book with them to their counseling session and, and shared some of that feedback and that's been very helpful. So I wrote this book because this is my story. This is my experience. I have been the woman who's married to a man addicted to pornography. You can download a copy of the first two days of my book on my own website, vickytd.com, on New Growth Press, and on Freedom Begins Here.